Cade, you've known the commander a long time. Have you ever seen him like this? Worst I ever saw Zavala was right after the great disaster. Didn't know the light could go out of an Awoken's eyes till then. But this... This is something else. He's scared. I've never seen him scared before, not like this. I understand the fear, I feel it too, but I... I don't know what he'll do with it. Eris once told me fear is a knife. We can use it to hurt others, or ourselves. But we also have the choice to sheathe it. <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe when we get over this mountain, we can make sure no one gets all stabby with their feelings. Got some taking popping up on my route. You all okay? Nothing I can't handle. If you need me to come over and give you a hand, let me know. Hey, now, who put who on their back when we threw down? <laughs> oh, come on. You caught me by surprise. Oh, well, I guess we're even then. Back. It's almost like he was never gone. Like the traveler knew it needed to make the fire team whole again. Uh, yeah, no, don't get me wrong. It's real nice to see you all again, but traveler. Too, little guy. That's the traveler. A witness is digging around in its guts. It's screaming for help. Good. We're here. We need backup. Girl wants to talk about how wonderful it is that the traveler brought me back. Like Ikora hasn't done enough of that already. It wasn't the traveler. It was me. I wished my way here on an Ahamkara. On an Ahamkara? The dragon that twists wishes and dreams into waking nightmares? What the hell made you think that was a good idea? We were out of options. I remember thinking that I wanted to do this because I had to make things right. And just before I took the plunge, I remember thinking about the great Kate Six. No light. 
no ghost, fearlessly staring up at me from the wrong side of his own gun. And there you were. And there I was. I should have told you sooner. No, no, you did the right thing keeping this between us. Ikora and Zobala can't know the truth. Not right now. They need faith. Right. And I need a drink. You go on, Guardian, you catch up. are followers of the witness. It's all divisive. The same zealots from the Black Garden. I know all about the Black Garden. You sure you don't want to talk about why you're back? The why doesn't matter. Never did. Just stay focused and clear path up the mountain. Listen, Crow, right now, I, I just need to do something that feels normal, okay? And blasting Vex feels really, really normal. Just know that the Traveler hasn't abandoned you, Cade. Even if you can't use the light, the light is still part of you. I don't think my wish could have brought you back without it. You could be capable of things you don't even realize.
first things my ghost Sundance said to me was that I was capable of greatness. You remind me of her a little. In what way? You're both a pain in my ass. What the fuck? Uh, fuck this shit, dog. I swear.
Dragon and Vex are in retreat. Good work. I'm picking up a massive new energy signature. Ghost, do you feel that? I do. The Vex mine must have been obscuring it. It's this way. Before we meet back up with the others, I meant what I said about keeping this wish business between us. I won't betray your trust, Cade. I know, but I gotta say it out loud. This is it. The energy signature is coming from over there. Past the cars where... where I found you. This is where I found your bones, Guardian. Where I brought you back for the first time. This is where everything started. There's an intense amount of light welling up from this fissure. That light? That's what it used to be like here. Pure and powerful. And of the golden feeling you get when you're holding a winning hand just... Forever. That power. It... Wait. Taken. We have taken incoming. Guardian, let's show them what the traveler gave us. still with us every step of the way well you weren't wrong kid you could just use a little tact because I could too for that matter maybe I Cora was right to try meditating if we could cut through the noise you think we can open a line of communication with the traveler something like that listen you and the Guardian go on ahead I'll see what I can puzzle out Oh my god, Jesus fuck no. This is a sign. Something's changed in the Guardian. New power, I can feel it. The Traveler can give us all the weapons at once, but without a plan on how to use them, we're as good as dead. <laughs> Worse. 
But we can't overlook the fact that it is helping us. Directly. It gave us Cade. And it's not enough. When I was... at my family's homestead, something reached out. A voice. A new voice. Calling to me. Trying to get my attention. That wasn't your wife. I know. It was a statue draped in a veil. A relic of the witness. What are you suggesting? You've seen the witness. You know what it wants to do to us. Maybe it's imprisoned others like that. No. It's a trick, Zavala. The witness is weaponizing your grief and desperation against you. What do you know about grief and desperation? Except how to turn it off. That's not fair. Listen, Commander. Cade thinks we still might be able to get insight from the Traveler. Commune with it, like Ikora was trying to. The Guardian received a vision before. Maybe they will again. Cade's out there right now, looking for a way. And when that fails... <clears throat> Then we'll think of something else. Traveler chose you, chose us. We were led here, shown where we first met, where you rose in the light. These new powers you've been able to harness since we arrived, they're growing stronger. You have too. The Traveler is empowering us to be its champion. Zavala may be dead set on striking at the witness, but I think Ikora is right. We have to commune with the Traveler. We have to have faith. We have to have hope. We can't let the witness pick us apart. The fire team needs you to anchor them, like we do for each other. Let's catch up with Cade and crew and find a way to make contact. <clears throat> Right here. Too. He's right <laughs> here, bro. Wandering. Crisis. The man lives and breathes crisis. Like, all right, he's having a hell of a week, but I think mean, he's the commander. Our friend is hurting. The traveler restored our family, while the witness dangles the family he lost in front of him. He needs something valid, a reason to believe. Well, I know about that. Look, there's a good chance this bet doesn't pay out. I I'm not looking to get into the false hope business. All hope is false if we let it die. Please, Cade. We have to succeed. For me. For Zavala. Well, when you put it like that, how can I say no? 